All right, so here we are. We're gonna make some rice. The first thing is, is you want your water to come to a boil. I have about two and a half cups of rice here, but my mother taught me a great trick so that it doesn't matter what size of pot you have. Okay. It's always gonna work. I so, am so excited about this. It, it really is wonderful. So um, before I had the rice though, so with heart failure, you have a maximum that you're supposed to be trying to stay under of 2,000 milligrams per day. And we are gonna put in a quarter teaspoon of salt. Now this will be for four servings, so that this amount of salt is actually a quarter of the amount that you're allowed for the day. So, but you gotta do it with this, with this. I'm sorry. <laughs> it doesn't work any other. Rice works. So we throw that in there. Okay. And now I'm gonna add my rice. The trick my mom taught me is if you can have the water be about half a teaspoon or half an inch to an inch above the rice, okay. it will be fluffy, beautiful rice oh, every time. That is a game changer. And that, tip. that is the trick. So I'm also going to add just a tiny bit of olive oil just so that it you know, doesn't stick together too bad. I'm going to say it's about a tablespoon. Probably a little bit less than a tablespoon. Mm -hmm. Stir. And then the other trick that she always stressed to us was you cannot lower the temperature until you see this really nice bubble everywhere. Okay. Once it's done that, you are good to go. Now if we were making Spanish rice, which maybe one day I'll show you, <laughs> there's like all these cool things that you do. But just for normal white rice, uh -huh. same thing with the wild rice. So now I got my nice beautiful bubble mm -hmm. and I'm gonna lower way down to just about a simmer. And then it's gonna do all the rest. So I'm just gonna put my lid on. And then the other thing she always said is, walk away. <laughs> Don't keep stirring it. Don't look at it. Let it do its thing. So okay. there we go. That's step one. All done. That's a great tip. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, we're gonna hop into the other part of our recipe.